team today. <laughs> um, so we're going to get straight into it. Uh, this will be kind of interactive. If you guys have any questions, go ahead and drop them in the chat and we will answer them as we go through. So recently I had the opportunity to, um, let me share my screen. Recently, I had the opportunity to go to a Vacation Express um, travel agent dinner show. Um, they had other other suppliers there as well, but they really came out and uh, talked to us about the different perks and different um, amenities that they have to offer our clients. And I'm gonna just chop my video off here so that we can not pay attention to my silly faces. <laughs> But um, so Vacation Express, if you guys have not, I know someone said they've been on the in the business for nine days. Welcome, welcome, and congratulations on um, you know completing your travel agent training. Uh, if you haven't already heard of Vacation Express, you can find more about them in the back office in the supplier uh, and travel cafe in the suppliers section, and I may um, be able to show you guys a little bit of that in the end. I'm not gonna keep you guys long, but I do wanna give you this good information. Uh, Vacation Express is a company or supplier that I have used before to get my clients really good deals. I mean, we don't always look for deals, but we have those clients that might reach out and say, hey, do you have any deals? <laughs> so this is one of those places I go to when I say, yeah, let me look and see what I have. So Vacation Express, we're gonna talk about finding the deals. So we'll first talk about how to get registered for this uh, supplier, the destinations that they serve. So a huge thing you wanna do as you're starting out, as you're getting into different suppliers and vendors is make sure you're looking at the destinations that they service before you're diving deep into a quote or your research. Um, you do want to, um, we're gonna talk about deals and how to find the deals for those specific dates. And then we can do a mock booking. So how do we register? So again, we're gonna go through Travel Cafe. Um, we'll go to the suppliers tab and then it, it's really uh, simple because you're just gonna send an email. And let me see if I can pull that up for you guys. So I'm gonna pull that up for you guys a little bit at the end and we can kind of go through that right before we do the mock booking. But you register through the Travel Caf Cafe and the supplier um, tab. It's gonna say how to register, you'll click there and then you'll follow the prompts. Okay, so we talk about what destinations do they service. So if you have a client that wants to go to Europe, Vacation Express will not be the, the vendor or supplier that you will use because they they serve Mexico and the Caribbean. So they're gonna uh, appeal to any clients that love those destinations and they're like all inclusive vacations. Those clients that wanna be able to pack their bags or to send you what they want, their destination, the accommodations that they like, pack their bags, pay their money, and then go. They don't, don't have to worry about anything when they get to the property. So this will be a great resource for you. Okay, so then we, we talk about how do you find the deals and those specific dates that they pertain to. So if you already registered with Vacation Express, then you're probably getting the marketing material in your email that says um, Barbados five night package for $1,296. So you're thinking to yourself, that's an incredible price for five nights that breaks down to about $200 a night total. So $50 per person a night. I wanna figure out how I can get this deal out to my clients or market it to my clients. Um, when I first started using Vacation Express, I would just be in there clicking away, right? <laughs> like, okay, I'm trying to find the deal. Where? How do I get this one, this vacation package for that price? Well, <laughs> the details are in the fine print. So anytime you click on one of their deals, you will be able to scroll all the way to the bottom of their website and it tells you their travel dates at the bottom and what departure port or port. <laughs> Clearly I have cruising on the mind. <laughs> what departure city um, those rates are for. So this particular one, it says if they travel, um, uh, it says it'll be $1,339 based on travel from Miami um, to Divi Southwinds Beach Resort for three nights. 
on March 30th. So you plug in your March 30th date, enter in three nights, and you can pull up the rate for our Divi South Wind. So I really love that about this. Um, I used to be able to pump out marketing material for these deals, and then I would just uh, sometimes add an additional commission because you have to keep in mind, you know, we, we are here to get people to experience, you know, the world, travel, vacation, memories. And in doing that, we are, this is also our business. So a lot of the times these deals have very small commissions uh, with the advertised price, but there is an option for you to add an additional service fee. So if you're going to do marketing on social media to your family and friends, I send out, if I make a flyer and post it on my social media, I also send that flyer out to my family and friends, different groups that I'm in. I might tell some coworkers as I'm walking past, <laughs> depending on what type of um, job you have. If you are working your business part time, you want to make sure you're talking about the business. Okay, so here's an example of, um, like I said, another offer that they had. So $399, right? If you post anything about travel on your page, on any of your social media pages, or send out an email, send out a text, and it says $399, all inclusive, including round trip air, that's going to attract multiple people to your site. They're going to respond back to you like, how can I book this? Um, that's what we call attraction marketing, right? So it's that that first um, that sticker tag price that we put out there so that it draws in the audience, right? So they put Vacation Express is really good about doing that, um, posting a picture of a beautiful all-inclusive resort. And then they they also have options for all of their other Caribbean destinations. So this one below is for Punta Cana. It's three nights, sorry guys, I thought my Zoom cut out on me. Okay, it's three nights all inclusive for $623. So again, you have access to get those dates and we're gonna look at that here in a few moments. But if you post that, send out a message, you can believe that it's going to attract people. You're gonna get bookings. I know a lot of times people come into the business or if you've been in the business a while, sometimes um, business may be up or down and you're trying to figure out how to get bookings, this is one way. We, we encourage everyone to be creative on how they're gonna market their business. And this is one of the first ways that I was able to do that and get bookings. Um, and we say that we do want you guys to be intentional or create an intentional audience. So that previous post or previous slide, it said this rate was from Miami. You can be on social media and start joining Miami Miami groups, <laughs> Miami home buyers, uh, Miami weddings, just different groups tailored to individuals that live in that area so that you can market to, to them intentionally. And then good old Walt Disney. <laughs> if you guys aren't registered with Disney, go ahead and do it. This is one of our preferred suppliers. Disney said the way to get started is to quit talking and begin doing. So let's go ahead and get into viewing a um, Vacation Express live. And we will do a mock booking. I will show you exactly what I was just talking about. All right. There we go. Size for you guys. Okay, everyone can see the screen, correct? Now, I do have an, I do have just a question for you all. How many people are already registered and utilizing Vacation Express for their clients? Drop in the chat below, and let me hide this. And I'm getting a box. Okay. Okay, we see some hands going up, some knees. Yes, guys, I. this is one of the suppliers that I do like now. Uh, we do like to say, you can kind of get yourself into a little bind if you only book one supplier all the time, right? So 
What I like to do is do comparison between uh, maybe Vacation Express and maybe Delta Vacations. I like to do comparison because overall our, our job our, the service that we provide is giving our clients quality service. So just because something might be cheap doesn't mean that it's going to be the best, best option, right? It's not going to be give them the most quality. Um, this, this deal may be, I'm just looking at this one right here on the screen, $488, but maybe another supplier has it for $600, but it includes um, a, a spa treatment or includes $300 resort credit, different things of that nature. So keep in mind, um, you you do want to do a comparison, or I recommend you do a comparison. Okay, so we're on Vacation Express. Okay, we're on Vacation Express. You will, Once you're registered, you will go ahead and sign in. Your mind should populate for me automatically. I'm trying to hide this. Okay, there we go. So one of the first things that I, I love about this, and you will see kind of a pattern, repeated pattern with other suppliers that we have, is they post their featured deals right on the front page. So if you're, like I said, if you're in a season where um, you, you feel like you need to figure out how to get bookings or you want to work on your marketing, then you just want to kind of log into a supplier, Vacation Express post theirs, boom, right when you, <laughs> right when you log in. They also have this deals tab that's here and it, it shows some of the main cities um, here that you can find deals from. I am in Detroit, so I often click on this one. But again, like I said, if you're doing that intentional marketing, you can kind of click from any of these cities, right? So then you get to this main page and let's see, let's just click and see what they have for their Black Friday um, specials. So they're doing a kids stay free deal with room upgrades. Um, they're going to give us some options here, some featured uh, resorts. And they do have a travel um, a travel window posted as well. Now let's see. I just wanted to show you guys like the fine print section on the bottom. Excuse me, guys. Okay, so this one isn't, let me go back up and click on the actual deal, a specific one. Let's do, all right, let's do Jamaica. And we're just going to click this one, November savings event up to 50% off, Jamaica round trip air from Detroit, three nights all inclusive from $949. Let's see if it's on this page or if I need to click once more. So it's going to give you some feature options as far as like the resorts. You don't have to click um, that particular resort that's up there. Okay, so here it goes. If you scroll to the bottom, it's going to tell you exactly how to get um, the price. Well, this one is probably one that was advertised a few few days ago. Sometimes it up, updates within 48 hours is what we learned at the Vacation Express Travel Show. So for $1,299, you can advertise uh, all-inclusive vacation from Detroit to Samsara Cliff Resorts in Jamaica three nights on November 25th. So if you have somebody that contacts you today and say, get me out of here. I'm ready to go. <laughs> I'm ready to go. What kind of deals do you have? You don't have to panic. Vacation Express is one place you can go to. Hey, give me a moment. Let me get back to you. Um, I, I'm sure I can pull some deals for you. Where would you like to go? You do want to qualify your client, right? You don't want to spin your wheels, but at least you'll be able to, to go to a supplier and pull up these dates. So let's do November 25th. We'll do a mock booking. We did pick Detroit, so we're gonna. Um, so right now I am under value price packages. They do have ho hotel only options and air only options as well. Uh -oh. All right, and then we are going to Jamaica. 
I also wanted to point out uh, the destinations. We did speak about that when the slides were up as well. As I mentioned before, they don't service every destination, right? So if it's Mexico or the Caribbean, this is a great supplier to come to. If not, then you wanna kind of research and look around at, at many of the other 133 suppliers that we that we offer, okay? And then it said departing on November 25th, which is next week for three nights. And I usually just type in the number of nights there. It'll populate the return date for me. Um, it defaults to one room and two adults. If you have more than that, you can always just click the drop down and increase your numbers here. Same thing for the adults and children. Okay, and then we do have a specific um, resort name that they told us, but I'm not going to put that in there just because I want you guys to see how it's going to populate everything for you. And then I usually just click continue. You can do more filters as they have them here. Okay, now we just let the magic happen. So for those who are on the line, do you have a particular destination that you use Vacation Express for? Is it Jamaica? Is it mostly Mexico? Is it a combination? Just want to get some feedback on, you know, Jamaica, uh, Vacation Express is your go-to for which destinations? Okay, Natasha, she said a combo. Combination of Mexico and the Caribbean, not just one particular country in the Caribbean or island. Okay, so here's what we have. We have our flight options here at the top. It gives you the best value first. This one is going from Detroit to Toronto and then Toronto to Montego Bay via Air Canada Express. Um, it tells you the time of the flight. Um, November 25th through the 28th and the return as well, as well as the times. So this one gives us, so again, it, it puts that featured resort at the top, Grand Palladium Jamaica Resort and Spa for $14.74 per person. You are able to view the different room categories here. The one that we saw on the on the deal, at the bottom of the deal was Sam Sarah Cliff Resort, if I'm not mistaken. And that one is showing at $1,044 per person. I do like to note that this is not an adult only resort. It does say it's all inclusive AI. It does say it has, you know, it allows children. And um, for $1,044 per person, this is their pre-Black Friday, Cyber Monday sale. You can click here to learn more about that sale. And you can also, so if you're selling or marketing this quick getaway, last minute getaway, <clears throat> as a Black Friday or Cyber Monday sale, again, get creative with it. You can always increase it a little bit. If they have, you know, if you want to market that, you can increase it and get them an ocean view room or a deluxe sea view room for still under, $1,200 a person, right, on Air Canada. So really, really good rates at a last minute deal. So then let's just go ahead and select, we'll select the deluxe sea view room. Okay, so your, your itinerary starts to begin to be built. Um, the package summary comes up, you see your flights again, and then here you have the hotel. So it breaks everything down for you. The check-in date, the checkout date, um, the three-night accommodations for two adults, and it gives you a little synopsis of the all-inclusive resort. And then the question that everybody wants to know, how much does this cost? How much is the, the guest going to have to pay? Um, how much commission will I, as the agent, make, right? So you do have the pricing here. It tells you, uh, one of the first things it tells you in the payment section is when the deposit is due because this is a 
last minute vacation. It's next week. <laughs> this is going to be due in full. So it shows the deposit due November 18th. Final payment is due November 18th, right? Uh, if this was booked for, if the day of departure was further away, then of course those dates would not be the same. Generally, it will be spaced out and then you can help to your client to develop a payment plan from there. Um, it does show that it includes round trip shared transfers. And then we spoke earlier and I said, um, generally with these deals, uh, they are, they don't have a lot of commission built into them. And you can always add an additional service charge that will go to your commission if you'd like to. Um, there is the option to send only the client copies, which, which is what we should be doing. Most of you on the line know that. So they won't see how much you're being charged, but we always like to say practice good ethical um, business. You're not gonna add a thousand dollars in here, right? To gouge this price because what will happen is now their package goes up to 3000 and you're always going to give them the total pack the total price you're never giving them the met, the net you're going to give them the gross so that will take their package up to $3300 and if they search that that same package online they're going to be able to see that your that your price is a lot more than what they're finding online they also have options to add additional um, items on here. If it's Jamaica, as you guys know, Club Mo Bay is a must. It, it is officially starting off their vacation once they get off the plane. If they have Club Mo Bay, they're going to be greeted at the plane. They're going to be fast-tracked through, um, through the lines, and then they'll be able to sit in the airport lounge and get their first rum punch, <laughs> okay? Get their vacation started off right. That's that value um, that we add into their service. So we can add that on there um, for $50 for two adults. And then they also have travel protection plans and you're able to click into any of these to see uh, the full scope of what the plan offers. Oh, I'm sorry, I don't think you guys could see that. It's probably a black box, but these are hyperlinks so you can click directly on them. And then of course we always love excursion. So if this is a last minute couple, they say we wanna do at least one excursion. We want to be a one-stop shop for our clients, right? We don't want to book them, you know, just to fly and then have them book their resort or just the resort, have them book their flight. When we can book the flight, the resort, the excursion, uh, Club Mo Bay, all of that in one, and then handle that for them, take care of it for them. And before you know it, your commission has already gone up and you didn't have to add extra, right? So you can add excursions to their package here. So then once you're, okay, well, let me take this out, guys. <laughs> so once you're comfortable with everything here and you have reviewed it, so make sure you're reviewing everything as well. Um, one thing that I always look for is that the hotel is, uh, I'm not booking non-refundable hotel rooms. I know a lot of agents that do, that does that. Um, I just personally don't. So that's something that I look out for. So if you know there's something that you particularly don't want to do for your clients, Make sure you're looking at the details for that. And then we can you can do save this itinerary. You can hold it for up to 24 hours or you can go ahead and book it if they are deposit. Well, in this case, pay in full. If it was a regular booking where there was more time in between, if they had the deposit ready. They also offer group travel. So you can do group travel as a fit booking where they will, you do your individual rooms and they will, you'll get a group code and they will link them. Excuse me, you will link them together. Okay, let's see. Barbara did have a good question. Let me see while I'm on here. Can you change the flight? So I just wanted to kind of go back so that I can answer that for her um, here. There's an option here that lets you change the flight. And this is this option is also there in the initial search. So if we go all the way back to packages and we do this search again. Barbara, you say you're trying to you're trying to go on this trip <laughs> yourself, huh? We're doing three nights. 
and then we're just going to do continue. So I'm just taking us back to the initial page, guys. Um, just starting over so that you can see it um, as if we had done it from the beginning. So let's say you logged in and you didn't like those flights for your clients. Yes, there is an option here that says more options. Oh, I highlight everything, but <laughs> more options. You just click there and it gives you multiple flight options. It does put the price increase here, which I really like that, um, that you can see that right away. So if, if your clients didn't want to go to Toronto from Detroit and then Montego Bay, mm -hmm. which I, I most likely would not have booked that <laughs> because it's kind of taking them backwards, right? But um, they could fly Southwest. They can go through Baltimore. Okay. Let's see what else they have. Oh, they have Chicago, Southwest Chicago or Detroit, Chicago, and then um, Montego Bay. Again, we, we have to put that value. Are we going to get them on two different stops to go to Montego Bay? Um, oh, Chicago Midway. Sorry about that. That's not two different stops. That's still one connection. But then you see it does increase in the price as you go up. Uh, I was trying to see if there was another airline offer. Okay, United Airlines has one from Detroit to Chicago O'Hare, which is the larger airport, the international airport in Chicago, and then to Montego Bay. So yes, and do you have different options? <laughs> she said that, that you don't want to wake up that early to get on a flight, huh? She said that 6 a.m. flight will not work. Um, how do we register if Archer is the host agency? Great question. So um let me just say um yeah I, I'm happy to grab questions right now guys like I said I wanted this to be interactive and so let me go to let's go to the travel cafe really quickly guys so that you can see how to register so if you don't already know when you're in your back office I generally use this menu on the side I just tri click Travel Cafe. I know a lot of agents already have the Travel Cafe open and bookmarked on their computer. I just still do it the way I learned it <laughs> when I joined four years ago, guys. Um, so we're in the Travel Cafe. In here, you're going to see tons of deals um, go and things going on in the company and different suppliers. So make sure you're checking this out. Then you can also scroll this menu over here. And this is where you're going to find the suppliers. So we're just gonna click on USA suppliers. And then um, you can read more, you can read information about suppliers and different uh, preferred suppliers in here. And then we're just gonna scroll down to Vacation Express guys. You could, you could have searched it in a top search bar as well. There you go. Oh, sorry, passed it. Okay, Vacation Express is here. And then you can click read more or continue reading. And then right here, so it tells you about the, the supplier. It tells you you earn up to 15% commission. One thing I did not talk about with the Vacation Express that I should have, they ha every, every month they have featured resorts. And those featured resorts, you can earn up to 20% commission with those. So they do, you know, give you an extra incentive for booking those resorts and they do generally change each month on which ones are the featured one. So if you have a particular brand that you like, um, double check them to see if you can get more commission or and also that it adds more value to your client's package. So um, it says how to register. And it says you're going to send an email to Angelica at archertravel.com requesting to be registered. Include your first and last name, Evo ID number. I would say anything that you're sending into Archer and even Evo, make sure you include your Evo ID number along with your first and last name, of course, your phone number and email address. Okay. Gives you a little bit of information about the BDM. Um, I do recommend if you have any specific questions about, okay, where can, how can I book my client on here? Or if something's going, going on and you're trying to use this particular supplier, I have just a good rule of thumb of going to my success coach first because a lot of times they are a wealth of knowledge and they can answer and get to you uh, a lot quicker than um, someone who is handling 16,000 agents, right? So just keep that in mind. 
Um, and then also the Facebook groups are also a good place to go and, and ask questions when you guys have them. And then I think maybe Gwen, are you asking? So Archer's IATA number, if that's what you're looking for, is 0582. 4840 and you will learn that by heart. <laughs> I was trying to see if I could see it on here. Okay, let's see. Okay, I'm gonna invite my lovely hostess, Miss Tracy, back onto the line to help with any other questions that you guys might have for me. Let's see. Can I Okay. All right, can we change flags? Okay, guys, were there any other questions? Well, like I said in the beginning, I wasn't going to keep you all long. Hopefully I was able to um, give you some new information that you hadn't already have or just a refresher if you've already had it. I did put my contact details on here. If you have any you know, specific questions or um, need assistance with anything, don't, feel, don't be afraid to reach out. We are a family here um, and we want everybody to succeed, especially me. Okay, <laughs> I want you guys to win. Thank you so much. Um, uh oh, hold on. Let me see. I think I, I wanted to. Do you ever get the deal that was referenced? Do I? Do you ever get the deal that was referenced? Yeah, I market those deals. So um, before you would go on my um, business page and you would see me posting like, um, you know, twelve hundred dollars per person to Jamaica, and I would have those specific dates that were in the that deal, or I would post it as a last minute um, getaway. I get really creative with the marketing and that's what I do recommend that you guys do. If there's something trending on social media, follow that trend, okay? Because your um, your posts will kind of come up in, into it. So yeah, I do. I absolutely do. Thank you guys so much. Enjoy the rest of your Saturday. Um, happy holidays, everyone. If I don't um, talk to you guys on a training before that, have a great evening. Thank you, guys.